I remember that I got the message in my hand in, in my mobile, sorry, um, from our label manager Marcus, and he said, "Yeah, you can do the next uh, DJ kicks," and I still have it in my mobile because it's so special for me. I said, "Okay, now we can do." Let's say we can do whatever we want because the DJ Kicks concept is so open. To us as producers, the DJ Kicks series was always something very special. Um, I must admit, I, I don't listen to that many dance compilations and, and club compilations. That, that sounds so interesting for me. But the DJ Kicks uh, is all, not that I heard every single one, but they were always different and they were always um, interesting to listen to and compiled by. by people that have something to say and that have a little bit of history. We don't have any experience in DJing, so we don't know how two records sound together. So uh, what we did was that we um, packed the computer with a hundred songs or tracks and just um, try it out. Just trial and error and, and look what happens. And um, then we were really happy that some stuff worked really well together. And of course we ask our DJs and our Get Physical family, they gave us some uh, some inspirations. As Walter said, we got all the, the songs on the computer and then ha had the computer on the road with us. So we were sitting in hotel rooms and on airports, backstage uh, in venues. Uh, our tour manager always had a laugh when we were discussing all the time and uh, discussing all the songs. Um, so yeah, the, the whole mix was pretty much done on the road. Uh, and then we only came to the studio and finished everything up. Look ahead on the screen, some perfect creatures and they're just This is it, the contact so much more than words can transmit. Licensing the, the tracks was, um, I think the major industry is the biggest problem, as usual. Because um, it's really, really hard to get these titles from a major industry because it costs so much time. If you take in one track out of the mix compilation, then it could be that the whole mix is not working anymore, so you can start again. and. Um, yeah, so, but it didn't happen for us, so the mix is fine now, we are happy. Bookershade is for us where the heart is. This is where we can do exactly what we want to do and we've been always great fans of electronic music. Um, but all this, all this background that we have, we wanted also to show the people. I mean, if we would do something for um, the, the buyers of the Get Physical Records, uh, it would have been probably easy to do an Electra House compilation or so. Um, and, and people would think, oh yeah, this is exactly what, what I know of them. But it's, it's also time to, you know, it's always good to surprise people and to, you know, push them a little bit. And there's so much from our past that we wanted to show people um, that this this was a brilliant uh, brilliant uh, time to do it and a brilliant possibility to do it. And on the other hand, you, you can listen to the to the track numbers to the DJ Kicks exclusive track. Um, it's a it's an untypical track for us. So it's um, normally you can't use so many harmonies and melodies and also voices. It's the first time that we are singing on a record. What's your number? can talk about it, I think, better than me, because you're the, yeah, more the movie guy. But you're the movie guy. No, you're oh, well, the well, we like, we like music, <laughs> we like uh, movie soundtracks. Um, from uh, the, the first Bukashade album on, the, the Memento album, which came out in 2004, uh, we, when we did this album, we were very much inspired by uh, putting videos uh, in, in, in the video play and just having the, the picture on without sound while we were working in the studio. Um, and working with pictures and, or with movies is very appealing to us. 
and just you know the combination of, uh, of the moving picture and the music um, that's what we like and that's why for example there's some some music from John Carpenter on the compilation It has a lot of atmosphere, and atmosphere is something we always care about. It's, it's always about emotion. You know, music is always about emotion, and, uh, and the getting the right getting the right notes together in order to create an atmosphere. That's something that John Carpenter, for example, is also perfect, and he also only has a couple of synthesizer notes, and you have instantly a certain atmosphere. And we wanted to, you know, take advantage advantage of this and and show the people, you know, how well this works with other electronic music, modern electronic music. So there is no punk music on the DJ kicks, but we have a quite wide range. So 40 years in one mix and it works. Okay, cool.